decide what school I wanted to go to, I chose that I wanted to be with the soccer teams because it's a sport I've been around my whole life. And then having done my observation hours at many schools, I decided that I wanted to be at Concordia because it was the most hands-on. Everyone was really friendly and it was the place I felt more, most comfortable. Everyone told me you're never going to see any injuries with soccer. You might see a few ankle sprains, a few concussions, but nothing major. And they were all proven wrong within the first 15 minutes. I had an open, an open fracture with two dislocations. A few hours later, a full ACL tear. I've had syndesmotic injuries, I've had concussions, unconscious players, I've seen so many things that most people won't see in their 600 hours they have to do field, whereas I haven't even completed my internship. They took everything I learned in class, they elaborated on it, they made me so much better and more confident. I've been exposed to so many new techniques, I know so much more than what I went in with and everyone's been so helpful and has shown me new ways to do rehab with serious injuries. I chose to do my internship at Concordia because I want to work with an elite hockey team as well as work alongside some established therapists like Sean, Christina and Marianne. Having done a previous degree and accumulating three years of field experience before coming to AT, it was easy to think that um, I knew all it took to be an AT. Um, but coming here, keeping an open mind and being in this environment uh, really showed me that just when you think you know everything, you don't really know that much and there's always room for improvement. So that to come from you know doing in-services here, we got to practice our techniques that we learned in school. Um, whether it's being able to jump on the ice with a player uh, to do some rehab or coming here right here into the gym, jump into a strength and conditioning session. It's also a really relaxed yet very professional environment in the clinic so you can jump into a treatment and kind of like learn on the fly. I really think that, you know, sports schedules are hectic. Um, there's always a lot to do, but having done my internship here really prepared me to kind of manage all those different factors into study time, into personal time. So uh, really prepared me for real life as an AT. I chose to do uh, both my field and my clinical here was because um, I was able to do both of them at the same place, which really interested me. To see both the athletes on field and off field in the clinic, uh, it's something I really enjoy doing. As well, the supervisors, they, they each bring uh, different aspects that they're good at and they, they teach in different ways and they'll, they'll, uh, they'll get you to know your niche a little bit better. And, uh, help mold you to make you a better therapist at the same time. For the new semester, we've all kind of organized into new in-services for just the clinical students and just the fourth year, so that fourth years get a different learning experience so they're not just reviewing the same thing over and over and over again that they've already seen in previous years. It also gives you a good opportunity to try a bunch of different things. You get to try strength and conditioning with uh, the teams. You get to work in the clinic. And you get to see the athletes on the field and get, uh, get field work done. and so you kind of get to see which sports you like to work with and which, uh, which aspects of athletic therapy that you want to work with most and what, what you enjoy doing and, and trying to figure out where you want to go in the future.